Let's take a look at replacing the coolant temp sensor on this 2001 Dodge Intrepid with a 2.7 liter engine. Now you can see I've got my 3 8 ratchet with a 3 quarter inch socket here. It's really all the tools I'm going to need. So let's take a closer look at the sensor itself and the front of the engine here, right by the, the outlet. All I need to do is depress the tab to remove the electrical connector, slide that out of the way. I'm going to take my socket, slide it over, and break it loose. Now we want to make sure that the engine is nice and cool before doing this, and make sure there's no pressure in the cooling system. If there is, it could cause some injury or burn marks. So we want to make sure it's cool. I can unthread this one. Be ready with my new one. You can see that there's already thread sealer applied to it. So we're all set. Once I get my old one out, I will thread in my new one here. Hopefully I don't get too much coolant loss. I'm going to start it by hand. Run it in there. Get a good start on it. Then I will take my ratchet and run it in the rest of the way. Once I've got it good and snug, I can then take my electrical connector, line up the tabs properly, clip it in, make sure it's locked on there properly, and now we've just gone ahead and replaced the sensor. You'll notice the bleeder screw on the top here. Now I'm going to want to crack that open and then go ahead and fill up my overflow jug, and then it's going to allow the air to escape out this. Once I get good coolant flow out of this, I'm going to tighten it up, seal it off again, clear any trouble codes, then I'm going to start the vehicle and make sure that our new sensor is operating properly. Hopefully now you understand how to replace the coolant temp sensor on a Dodge Intrepid with a 2.7 liter engine.